I wake up in the morning, turn on the news, social like a flood as I'm scrolling through the noise, the hate, the name calling, the threats. I stop, I put the phone down, and I take a breath. Eyes closed, I wonder, how did we fall so far? We are a people at war, right here at home, driven further apart until we each stand alone. But we are meant to stand together, stand as one, brothers and sisters, children of God. With a growing divide, a deepening wound, words like arrows fly, their whistle tuned to anger. But we need conversation, respectful debate. Instead, we throw hooks with poison bait, fishing for insults, barbs sharpened with hate. How did we get here? How did we forget who we really are, our purpose, our potential? The darkness of hate leaves us stumbling, lost, turning father against daughter, sister against brother, and with every step we take, suffocating, all-consuming, destroying all in its wake. So where is the light? Where is the love? It is within each of us, because God is in each of our hearts, His essence, pure love. When we embrace His love, meditate, immerse ourselves and contemplate, be this love. Our love for others shines. It is our natural state. We remember we are all children of God. We remember only love can drive out hate. We lose our way when we judge each other by the color of our skin, our party, religion, or kin. But we find our way by looking within. Inspired by the words of Dr. Martin Luther King, Love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. So close your eyes, rest in God's loving embrace. With aloha, reach out, extend a loving hand, be the change across the ocean, across the land. Live love, live aloha.